welcome to another episode of Baron of TV, designed to demystify the world of accounts and tax and to help your business grow. Now this episode I wanted to talk to you about YouTube. Um, I talked in a previous episode about the value and the benefits involved in um, producing a series of videos such as Baranov TV and how it can really help your engagement with your customers and to build relationships with them um, by putting your videos on your website and having them by definition then hosted somewhere um, and I suggested either Vimeo or YouTube. Now we actually host ours on both platforms. Um, YouTube is the second largest search engine after Google and as a result um, you really want to have your videos on there um, but one of the downsides that people talk about on with YouTube is that at the end of your videos unless you have a paid um, account at the end of your videos it will suggest other videos and what you don't want is people watching your video and then going off and seeing the competition um, but there is a way around that um, when you set up a video on YouTube you can use tags now we use tags such as business growth tax accounts whatever is relevant to the episode that we're actually posting but we also use a specific tag for Baranov TV and if you do that, what you hopefully will find over time is that YouTube will start to suggest your videos with that same tag, particularly if you use that tag first, instead of suggesting your competition's videos with the same tag. So what you want to do is actually decide on a tag, use it first on your tags, and hopefully, as I say, over time, that will make a difference. The other thing I've got to mention to you is obviously um, our behaviours are changing as far as videos are concerned. There's more and more of them. We're watching more and more of them, but we're watching more and more of them without putting the sound on. So you really do need to make sure that you've got captions on your videos. Now I mentioned before using rev.com to get the captions file produced for you really, really cheaply. Um, but once you've got that, when you upload your video to YouTube, you need to force those captions to be on. And that's really easy to do by actually adding an additional tag, which is YT colon CC equals on. And what you're saying is for YouTube, you want your captions to always be on. Now I'll put that at the bottom of the screen, but that's a really easy way to make sure that your captions are always visible to your viewers. Um, so I'm going to finish this video and I'm going to get it uploaded onto YouTube and Vimeo. Um, I hope it's worth for, worthwhile and I hope it's useful um, and I'll see you all very soon.